This is the Lenovo ThinkPad T431S laptop, another addition to the T-Series put out by Lenovo that's kind of a combination of two different generations of ThinkPad. Um, we have the characteristic black look with a carbon fiber lid and a magnesium alloy bottom. A uh, very durable laptop. On the side I.O. we have USB 3.0 mini display port and a fan grill. Over here we have the RJ45 Ethernet port, uh, connection for the power adapter, VGA port, USB 3.0 SD card reader, uh, microphone, headphone, in, out, and a uh, PCIe half mini card uh, port. We turn off the lights to showcase the two-tier backlit keyboard, which is a nice option for working in darker areas. And of course we have the characteristic red track point. Um, still fairly intuitive with this style of touchpad. And I actually upgraded the display on this particular version because the previous LCD was um, destroyed and it's 1920 by 1080 and it really makes a huge difference. This did not ship with this uh, FHD style LCD. Here we have an Intel Core i5-3337U CPU, 2 core, 4 thread, 8 gigabytes of 1600 MHz RAM, a King DN 120 gigabyte M.2 SSD, an HGST 500 gigabyte hard drive for storage. And we also have the Intel HD 4000 for graphics. Um, so this display allows you to watch uh, 1080p video and have it look really good. One of my videos playing in the background, not the highest of quality, but good example. And as you can see, the LCD is viewable from all angles the matte finish and anti-glare is a really nice feature on the eyes and really crisp to look at. So of course we have to look at how it games. So I only tested out Left 4 Dead 2 um, because I don't have high expectations for the HD 4000 integrated GPU but um, playing windowed, I was able to manage 55 to 75 plus frames per second. And it again, on the upgraded LCD, this game looked really good. So within expectations, you can have a good time gaming on this laptop still. And the webcam, 720p. I'm going to show that off. And here's a final look at the outside of the case. Again, the carbon fiber and magnesium alloy, top and bottom. Really durable laptop, even considering how small and thin it is. Well, hopefully this uh, helps you decide if you'd like one.